for first down. Rosen. Dances out of the pocket and hit as he throws. Incomplete. Or is that what picked up? Jared Johnson with the sack. And Texas A&M has it inside the UCLA five. Armani Watts scooped it up and almost got into the end zone. This is going to be very close. As Rosen is rolling to his right, Jared Johnson's going to beat Colton Miller to the left tackle. And Rosen tries to set up and throw. And that ball that is going to be awful close. Now, I thought Johnson has made contact before that hand was starting to come forward. I'll be shocked if they don't look at this. But see how Early his on the field is a fumble. We turned to the deep by the defense. The control. This play is now under further video review. That Rosen has of the football will be what they are going to watch in this replay. The offensive line is on it. Continuing to dominate and watch Williams down the sideline. Can he get there? Williams! Finally knocked down inside the 10 by Nate Metters. They give it to him. Can he get in? Yes, he can. Touchdown, Aggies. Smash Mount football. That's what they call it in Texas, Joel Klatt. That you were talking about. First and 10 to the 44. Play fake. Where is it? There's the deep ball. Down the field. He's got a receiver. And inside the five, Jordan Lasley. Rosen put that one up and on the money. A couple of flags out. This is going to be pass interference. Pass interference. Number 14 of the defense. Penalties decline. The result of the play is a first down. It's exactly what they're able to do is find some sort of success. It started with the run game. They get the first down, and then a big, heavy play action fake from Josh Rosen, and he's able to get the ball down behind the defense, and lastly comes down with it. A 54 yard reception. First and goal at the two yard line for UCLA. Handed to the up man. Starks pushing forward. Touchdown, Bruins. Well, they needed that answer like they needed air to breathe in this game. First down at the 39 for the Aggies. Williams over 100 yards rushing. Williams again. High step it. Big time. 61 big ones, touchdown Texas A&M. Travion Williams, 15 carries, 188 yards and two touchdowns. And he's got a scepter he's feeling that good about himself. Rosen, quick start, looking. Over the middle. Oh, Touchdown Bruins, Darren Andrews. Uh-oh. And we have eight minutes and 12 seconds to play. 96 yards right down the field. Rosen makes a huge mistake. That is right in the hands of Deshaun Caper Smith. And it goes right there. Andrews was surprised. Josh Rosen under pressure. Throws. Touchdown. Theo Howard. What a throw by Josh Rosen. which was Jamabo, and he just dumps it off for a first down. Rosen fakes the spike, and he ends up touchdown! Whoa! Jordan Lasley! The legend of Josh Rosen! In for blue! Dan Marino would be proud!
Are you kidding me? But the most important thing now, J.J. Molson in to attempt the extra point to give the Bruins the lead. Freshman wants to run it. Can he get there? Mom, take him down. And it looks like he has the first down. After video review, the runner was only able to make advancement to the 34-yard line. Since the line to the game was a 35, the ball's turned over on downs. First down, UCLA. UCLA 20 seconds away from one of the most miraculous comebacks that you can ever see. Josh Rosen, chosen. Empty set for the freshman. Oh, picked off! Fowler Nicolosi is picked off. It's Andrew Simpson, the linebacker. Ball went right to him. Don't think Fowler Nicolosi saw him, and he's holding that elbow as he took a hit, too. Keep him out of the end zone. Genty remains in at running back. Second and goal. It's Ashton Genty powering his way in for his third touchdown of the game. Wow, that was... He made up his mind he was going to score on that play. And Same quarterback in the game for Colorado State. Braden Fowler, Nicolosi, back to pass, four-man rush. He takes a shot as he lets it go. That one complete to Holker. In two weeks when they take on Wyoming. Oh. Quickly zips it out to Goffney. Goffney breaks a tackle and picks up the first down. Clark wrapping up. Fowler Nicolosi floats it up there. Great throw, better catch by Torrey Horton over the shoulder. Ball into his catch there compared to that one he dropped where he took his eye off it. Plenty of time all day for Fowler Nicolosi. Back over the middle, and again it's Horton, and he is coming to life with 4.24 to go. First down from the 12-yard line. Fowler Nicolosi to the end zone. What a grab by Lewis Brown. Over the shoulder, goes up to high point that ball. My goodness, we've seen a couple of fantastic catches by Torrey Horton and Lewis Brown. Quickly and get the ball back again. Yep. Boise State's got the hands. There's Genty right there inside the 50-yard line. Oh, McAllister oh, scores away. And Colorado State's on it. Colorado State recovers it. It's Vince Brown. Recovering the football on the onside kick, and folks, suddenly things are getting interesting on homecoming here in Fort Collins. Let's see what they can put together here. Fowler Nicolosi looking the left side. Pass complete to Brown. Downs don't matter at this point in the game until you get to fourth. Keep it on the ground with Van, Van Shield inside the 20-yard line, finally thrown to the ground by Rodney Robinson, but the 241, trying to get into the end zone again. Pressure coming, lets it rip. Here's Horton. This is where everything's condensed, third and goal. Up top to the corner of the end zone. Brown makes the catch, but Colorado State here, fourth and goal. Three-man rush to the middle of oh, the that's field. P.I. There's a late flag. Oh, there it comes. Late flag. That'll give him four more downs. He's just about sure in the end zone. The ball's placed at the two-yard line. Hooked him with the yeah, left arm. Sure did. Down. Got him right around the waist. That is missed. Colorado State trying to score here, and they do. Dylan Goffney in for the touch. Shale Adipo was there in coverage, and with under two minutes to go, it's a one-score game. Get it back if you hold them. And, and regardless of where on the field they are, if they get a first down, and here's the onside kick, bouncing around. Colorado State has a shot, and they get it! The Rams are alive on homecoming, ladies and gentlemen. Gatkuth with the recovery. Illegal block before the ball traveled 10 yards. Oh Five-yard penalty against the kicking team. We will replay the kick. Oh, oh my gosh. Should we cover the kick? Now let's take another look at this. It could be right there. on Genty, but boy, 
football before the ball traveled 10 yards. So they're giving it another shot. After the penalty, they have to kick it again. And this time, Genty. right to Genty. It doesn't take that same type of bounce it took the last time. And here's Tyler. Tone oh. Reed coming. Green's going to keep it. There he goes. Breaks one tackle, trying to get around the edge. We got Jaylen a penalty, Green though. It's coming back. Bounds, and he does. It's coming back. We got a penalty, and it stops the clock. And the running ability. Oh, Offense number 85, 10-yard penalty. Three play second down. Do here, they don't stop the clock. Here's Crow. Puts his head down, and fourth down coming up. James Ferguson Reynolds lets it fly. That's oh, one wow. of the best things that could happen. Look at that. Look how much time ran off there. Yeah, you got to throw one up and give your guys a chance. Four man rush once again coming. Fowler Nicolosi stepping up in the pocket, letting it go. And then there right away, Shale Adipa. Regardless, 17 seconds on the clock. Eric clock's running. And a fresh set of downs. Bauer Nicolosi climbing the pocket again. Taking a shot. Here's Horton catching it at the 35. Seven seconds to go. Clock stopped. Great throw. Great throw, great catch. They're going to clock it, and then we'll have a Hail Mary to end the game. There's the clock. Thursday night. Colorado State. Looking for their first win ever against Boise State. One final shot. Fowler Nicolosi chucking it into the end zone. Everybody is there. Is it caught? Is it caught? Colorado State. Dallin Holker makes the catch. It's a miracle in Fort Collins. We're tied up. Just when you think you've seen, just when you think you've seen everything in college football. Oh my. Okay, God. they should, good chance we're going to get a celebration penalty here and move this extra point back. There's your little bunch formation. And they're going to, and they're bringing another guy across from the other side. So they're creating their four man. Boise State actually tips it. There's the trailer. That's why you say you teach them to knock it straight down into the ground. They tip it straight. Great positioning. They did. Yeah, that's that's an awesome job right wow. there. That's an awesome job by Holker being right where he should be. Look at Holker getting in position for the tip. What a tremendous catch for the young man who transferred from BYU. They said he has been an unbelievable addition. Open. After review, the touchdown is good. On the All right, that moves it back 15 yards on sportsmanlike conduct. Woo! That's a 31-year-old from England can do what has never been done before in Colorado State history. Oh, the kick almost got it. Is up and the kick is good. Ram tough in Fort Collins for the first time in 13 tries. Colorado State takes down the Broncos. What an unbelievable comeback. That was remarkable. Uh, one of the most popular things in the world and keeps people coming back for more. Coach said they really think he does all the right things all the time. They try to get it out there. Oh, man, that ball skipped. <laughs> Jameer Jordan going down the sideline and he's going to take it for six. Touchdown Bulldogs. Virgil going up the field, got a wide open receiver in stride. It's Jordan, touchdown Bulldogs, 65 yards. A little bit of momentum on the ground for the Hurricane. Evans going for it all, receivers there, does he hold on? Yes, touchdown Tulsa. 23 yards, Justin Hobbs with the score. Evans looking to his left, looking for Lucas. He's got it. Touchdown, Tulsa. He's number two, the second wide receiver up top. Evans up over the top. It's Lucas. He's wide open. He'll take it for six. Touchdown, Tulsa. 
if you're the Hurricane. Evans, the throw, the catch is made. Atkinson's in. Touchdown, Tulsa. Virgil, the throw. Boy, that's picked off. It got tipped and picked. And it's going to be Tulsa football. And Evans, pump fake, looking down the field. And that's picked off. Bulldogs get it right back. Jamal Ellis. The line of scrimmage for another play. They want Pater. It's Flanders. He's in. Touchdown, Tulsa. Game tied at 34. And he's going to keep it. And he's in. Touchdown, Bulldogs. It's really a unfolded. One, huh? It has been a wild roller coaster ride for everyone involved. It's only right that we play a little longer. And Dane Evans keeps it himself. Evans to the end zone. Touchdown, Tulsa. They got to give him a shot at the sticks. Needs 17 yards to keep this game alive. Virgil's going to step up. He's got a throw. Stays on his feet. Looking downfield. It's up for grabs. Game over. Tulsa wins in double overtime, 48 to 41. With his season, this one officially 32 yards. Oh, the snap wasn't great. And the hold was bottled, and that led to a blocked kick. Just the second miss of the year for Boomer. And make sure he doesn't have to put on his cape. Continue to lean into what the offense allows for him to do. Oh, my goodness. Matt Jones blows into the backfield. Play action, and McLean goes down. And Henshaw has done a good job of seeing McLean, keeping him under control, nope, nope. mixing in the pass and the run. McLean into trouble! Knocked down. Ball and ran right through the middle, wide open on last player. How about this time? This time it works, this is Baldwin! And he's put that about to the 16. Still a ton of time, folks. We yeah. just they give him four. Yeah, we got four somehow. They give it to the gun of Harvey, trying to get him to the right edge, and that doesn't work. Can't get past Matt Jones. And, and I think... Low snap. McLean. Just a four-man rush. They can't get to him. Incomplete. No penalty flags. It's going to be a three and out for UCF. Whoa, look at the kick go. He's got the first down. They found something with Dawson Pendergrass. Down! Snap with the beauty. And the kick is even better! Baylor takes a one-point lead! 59 yards for the win! It's not gonna make it! What a win! One of the most improbable. I am Anor as well. On third and three, there's one of them complete, and it's going to be first and goal, Cardinal. I am Anor. Little bootleg action. Ran into some traffic. Up for grabs. And incomplete in the end zone. Illegal substitution. Defense. 12 men on the field. Half the distance to the goal. Wow. Replay third down. E.J. Smith in the backfield, third and goal. Jet sweep, touchdown Cardinal. He's not going to lose many foot races. Bryce Farrell with the touchdown. Daniels looking to throw. Guys, man. And a good hit short of the end zone. And Yorosik will come up short. Sanders steps up. Eludes some rush. Again. Sanders slings it. Hunter won't get there in time. And it's going to be fourth down. So Definitely an incomplete pass. Bassett with his first punt of the night. And it'll roll. They'll have a chance to down this inside the five at the three-yard line. The Cardinal got a nice stop and got off the field a moment ago. They've got 97 yards to go. Daniels finds his man. Io Manor still on his feet. One man to beat. 
He's going to score. The Cardinal. Touchdown. Trying to make a run. 97 yards in a blink. He's just been, yes. he's been killing. A guy that came out of the portal, a transfer, who's endured two ACL surgeries. That pass complete, Travis Hunter going to be stopped short of the first down. Interesting situation here. Analytics data. Second point of the night for Bassett. And it's going to bounce in favor of the Cardinal out of bounds at about the 37, 38 yard line. That's great. Field. Graded out well against Arizona State. E.J. Smith in the backfield. They're going to pass. Daniels downfield. Back shoulder fade. Caught. Io Manor got real estate in front of him. One guy to beat. Races. Scores. Touchdown, Stanford. They have come back with religious fervor here in the third quarter. 60 yards. We've got a ball game. And once Shador broke the pocket. Third and nine gets rid of it quickly. Hunter trying to make something happen. He's going to be stopped up short of the first down at the 46 yard line by Fausto Ramos. Number 12, you go to Travis Hunter, you run up across the field in some kind of shallow. Sanders retreating in trouble and Stanford will take over on downs. Good pressure by Lieber. That's great team defense. We're going to have some grounding here. Ball down. He's found a nice rhythm for himself. Looking at Isle Manor. Finds him. Forward progress will be marked at about the 19. Right here and right here. Those are the two guys. Little blitz coming. Out and up. Isle Manor couldn't hit him. And a flag down at the 18 yard line. First bill foul. Illegal block below the waist. Offense. Number two. 15 yard penalty. Third down. Third and 22. Back at the 31. Daniel's going to be sacked for a loss of one on the play. By number 29, Roderick Ward. Roderick Ward, the first guy to get there. I think we're going to get a personal foul. And you're going to see Travis right After here. The play, personal foul. Unnecessary roughness. Defense. Number 12. 15 yard penalty. Automatic first down. So that's the composure part yep. of the game. Double move down here at the bottom of the screen. You had him before. Looking that way again. Now going through the progression. At the eight, complete. And out of bounds at the two yard line. It's Bachmeyer, the runner. Gonna keep it. Touchdown, Stanford. They keep on coming. Justin Lamson with his first score of the night. Travis Hunter trying to figure out what is happening right now, along with 52,000 of his friends. Edwards in the backfield beside Sanders. Clean pocket, shot downfield, got a man. Cut. Weaver with the reception, got in behind Colin Wright. And the Buffaloes sprinting to the line of scrimmage. One situation's in any time they can get him singled up. Into the end zone. Touchdown. Hunter held on to it after he took some smoke from Lieber. Single safety high. They have gone to him. Looking his way. They find him. Makes the catch out to the 30-yard line. Right at the first down marker working against Carter Stoutmeyer. It's like clockwork. Mm. They're just looking for it. Again. Working Stoutmeyer like a part-time job right now. Daniels on the toss to the wide side of the field. Nice cut by Filkins. Coming back after reversing his field and pushed out of bounds. They're going to spot it at the 45. Lined up against Hunter. Found the spot in the defense, sat down, made the catch, and moved the chains. Bentley making the tackle, 41 yards. 
the bootleg. Pass complete inside the 10 to Bachmeyer. Now it looks like they're having some substitution yeah, errors again. again. Issues. One player trying caught. to get off the field. Flag down. Pass incomplete, but again. Illegal substitution. Defense. 12 men on the field. After this is the goal. Third down. Third and goal. Daniels into the end zone. Caught. Touchdown. Farrell. And it's a one-score game again. He beat Carter Stoutmeyer on the play. But still Friday the 13th here. Shador Sanders gets rid of it quickly, caught in the flat, and plenty of room. First down run by Dylan Edwards. Notre Dame commit, flipped his commitment, came to play at Colorado. Here he is again on the run. Kept those knees high and makes it up to the 49-yard line, picking up seven. Off of the clock. Mm. Edwards trying to get through the hole and got rocked by Sinclair. Tristan Sinclair, fifth-year senior out of Alamo, California. A little bit too late, though. They moved the chains on the first down. For any linebacking core in college football right now, so do you really just continue to go to him in this situation? Shador downfield, overthrows it. Intended for Hunter, and the Cardinal will have an opportunity. That's what they wanted. Fourth down and nine, they punt. Looking at the coffin corner here. <laughs> That's his coffin <laughs> corner as it gets. Wow. So the Cardinal 99 yards away. Filkins in the backfield, out of his end zone. Pass complete to Io Manor. Single safety. 13 is the guy. Second and one, empty formation. Daniels going to take off. Pick up the first down, steps out of bounds. Got a little bunch formation here. Daniels looks the other way. Incomplete, but a flag thrown against Stoutmeyer. He was. That's an easy call to make right here. See him press coverage. They throw this back shoulder. And you run into the wide receiver in the 150 to go. Daniels delivers a strike to his tight end. Roush picks up the first down and then some. Out to the 43, picked up 15. Some split safety looks because he knows anytime they go one on one, it's been a problem. Complete. Brought down to the 47-yard line, Ruben. Different coverage. Two high looks, single high looks, press man, off man. Iomeyer and Hunter at the bottom of the screen. Hunter jumped it, but Iomeyer got there first. What a grab for the first down. Unbelievable. Individual effort by Alec Iomeyer. Second and ten. Daniels complete. They're going to spot it inside the 30-yard line to Farrell. they got to get to the 19. Daniels on a quarterback run. He called a timeout. And he'll pick up field a goal. yard or two. Roderick Ward making the tackle on the play. For the tie. Drills it. And we're knotted at 36. <laughs> And we will go to overtime. Hunter in space and gets down at the 16-yard line. Electric all night working from the slot, man. He has done it all. Hankerson with a yawning hole inside the 10 at the 9-yard line. Up, mugged up in the A gaps. Sanders. Shador Sanders delivers a dart. And you've got the one on one again down here. And that's where they come battling. Oh, oh what a my grab! Gosh. What a highlight! I am Manor! Mind your manners! What a catch! <laughs> That'll make your Sports Center top 10. He took it off of Travis Hunter's hat. 
Holy cow. Watch this. The throw. The, he takes it, he traps it to his back of his helmet and pulls it off of it. He peeled it right off of his dome for a touchdown. Neither could we. Sanders on first and 10 from the 25. Hankerson with a nice move. Picks up eight down at the 12-yard line. Sanders keeps it, made a nice move, and slides in safely right around the 11-yard line. Showing blitz, dropping out, lobs it up high for Hunter. There's the flag, incomplete. That'll be pass interference against Frausto Ramos. Got their Rick Ross formation in. They brought in the extra defensive tackles. Hankerson bowed up, but was stopped short of the end zone. See what Sean Lewis dials up on this play. Mm. Hankerson met right behind the line of scrimmage. They'll lose some yardage. It'll be third down and gold. Antonio, he's six foot four, 225 pounds. Sanders gonna pass it. Can't find anyone on the move. Finally gets rid of it. Picked off in the end zone. Intercepted by Gilman, the leader of that secondary. And it'll be Cardinal football with a chance to win this football game. How much do you want to risk? Keep it in the middle of the field. There you go. Daniels. The ball handling between with the quarterback. And if you're Daniels, you just want to cover up that ball. Well, that's what he did and got the first down. Josh Cardi from 31 yards out. Trying to snap the four-game losing streak. With a strong second half for the win, the Cardinals storm into Boulder and run back to the farm in Palo Alto with the dub. 46 to 43 in a stunning comeback victory. Elik Ayomano did a lot of the heavy lifting offensively. season and right into the hands of Josh Woods. A couple of touchdowns a game through their first three games this year and a completion down inside the 15 for a first down. Dance to the right side and on second down to the air again and a completion for a touchdown to Joshua Kelly. Great offense but how does Anthony Gordon and this offense respond to that turnover just a moment ago? And they'll answer with a first down to Travell Harris. The they had one on their first drive, could not extend the drive, 0 for 1. And they won't need a third down here. First down for Winston, out five wide. Gordon with time, rifles that one complete down inside the 25 to Winston, who's already got his third catch. Winston right now. Okay. Across the middle, down inside the five to Tay Martin. Own receiver to the left. Borgie on the move, the sidearm for six. Gordon to Winston. A little better, a little better. As a big fan. We've got a 7-7 ball game here on the Palouse, and Asi Asi across the middle, first down UCLA. Kelly, they had him momentarily, and he will work his way for the first down and an extra yard. Had Kelly back, he missed a couple of games. Time for Thompson Robinson and a strike down to the 25 yard line. He'll hand it off. Thompson Robinson tried to drop it off to Ozzy Ozzy. It oh, may have been better served to just run it himself right there. Uh, One yard attempt. And he's got it, the first of the year. Gordon, incomplete. Terrific pressure coming right at him from Keyshawn Lucier South. Allowed Gordon to be sacked three times this year. Down the middle and caught at midfield. I'm 
of the year in Pullman. And it's paying dividends. Deep downfield again. And another first down to Arcanado. Looking to go over the top. And the reach out and the catch is made by Winston. And that's his second touchdown of the ball game. 28 yards from Gordon. Good so far. A lot of other folks trying to take, uh, take his lead. That was almost caught and then bobbled and intercepted. This is why Holmes is one of the best DBs in the country. That's great coordination. Two takeaways in the first half tonight for the Bruins. And they'll give it right back. Bad decision by Thompson Robinson, and it's taken away by Skyler Thomas. Conversation at the end of the year. And it's the third touchdown toss of the first half for Anthony Gordon, this time to Travel Harris. 10 to seven at the end of the first. Have not had to punt yet tonight. And this is Felton on the receiving end of the kickoff. Weaving his way out across the 35, breaking a tackle, and he is gone. Flag down at the 20-yard line behind him as Felton takes it home. Big, and that's a monster win for Coach Helton and his players. Suddenly, USC is back in business with the tough schedule that they have. They could make some noise. Not only good through the air, but good on the ground as well for Anthony Gordon. For sure. If you're a lineman, though, wouldn't you block for a guy like <laughs> Absolutely. No question. Borgie breaks a tackle in the backfield, and look at the effort down to the 20-yard line. Luke. Record last year with his 12 touchdowns. Look at the time for him to direct traffic. Gordon down inside the five to Tay Martin, and it's first and goal. Going to start over UCLA quarterback, and it's the fourth touchdown pass of the half for Anthony Gordon, and the third catch for a touchdown for Aesop Winston. Country, they're at 28 and they're looking for more. Receiver screen, Desmond Patman. Gordon already 240 yards through the air in the first half. All day to throw it, a missed tackle, a stiff arm, and he's going inside the 30 and knocked out of bounds at the 20 yard line, Roderick Fisher. Play action with Borgie. Look at the time. And now Gordon will tuck it and go diving down to the five yard line. And it's first and goal. Third and goal out of the timeout. To the end zone. Back shoulder. Did Martin get the feet down? He did. Touchdown. Washington State. Thompson Robinson. Find time. He will heave it. The distance pops up and it's caught by UCLA down to the one yard line. And they come up a yard shy. You know, he has another top piece. He had a, both a rushing touchdown and a receiving touchdown against Northern Colorado a couple of eight if there's not protection for the quarterback. And they've given Gordon just that tonight. And a quick hitter for another first down out to the 48 yard line. Off the play action, Gordon will drop it off to Borgie. First down and more. Down to the 35-yard line. That'll move the chains again. 15 yards through the air. Everything. They love those kind of guys. Let the cat out of the bag. Gordon looking deep down the middle. Has a man that caught for a touchdown for the fourth time tonight. And it's actually fielded by the up man short. With room to run, Aesop Winston down to the five yard line. He's looking for one. And he's got one. He just tied Gardner Minshew's record with a seventh TD pass of the night. Uncertainty, I guess, might be the better way to say it at the start of the season. Didn't know what you were going to get. But boy, have they performed well. Way too easy right now for Washington State. Good push again, but a nice broken tackle. Kelly, first down yardage inside the 44. Rifles it down the middle, caught inside the five, Jalen Irwin. Quarterback will keep it, touchdown Bruins. Aesop's caught three of them. The slant there to Fisher. 
Did the ball come out at the tail end of that, or were, was it blown dead? The referee's kind of let No, that they're going to give it to the Bruins here. How long do we go here, right? So it gets pulled out. It's interesting. What position? Thompson Robinson with the time. Fires it downfield. Caught by Coda. Did he stay up? Yes, he did. Touchdown, UCLA. Hold on now. And, and they got it going again. Felton with a stiff arm. Felton with another Ooh. stiff arm. Demetric Felton. A 100-yard kick return earlier tonight, and now a 94-yard touchdown catch and run. This bell. Plenty of time to pick out a receiver. Another broken tackle, a couple of them, and the ball is out. And the Bruins have forced another takeaway, and they've got it at the Wazoo 35. Deep ball down the middle, inside the 10-yard line. Caught by Greg Dulcich. Guards on that play. Got it in his hands again. Look into the back of oh, the play. end zone. Touchdown. Asi, Asi. And it's a 28-point run right now for the Bruins. Point under Chip Kelly here tonight. If they can come all the way back from a 32-point second-half deficit. Gordon caught out at midfield for the first down. Aesop wins the pressure coming. That first down throw down inside the 35 to Bell. Over the top, and it's caught at the 10 and into the end zone. Aesop Winston with the touchdown. Does it UCLA have an answer for that score? Oh, and the hurdle. Over the defender there by Joshua Kelly. They deserve to be on the field. DTR slings it out wide. Felt making people miss all night long. Down the seam, Coda continues a big night. First and goal, UCLA. He'll keep it. He's already got one rushing touchdown, and now he's got another. Spiraling towards the left side. And the Bruins will be able to bring it back. They've already got one special team score tonight. Phillips with one wow. man to beat. And he does. <laughs> and UCLA scores for the sixth time in a row that they've had the football. And they take the lead. I'm in shock. This is been the funnest game of the day with all the offense and everything all the big numbers being put up UCLA fighting this entire game doing it on special teams kickoff return for 100 earlier in the game Gordon Borgie out of the backfield first down and a beautiful cut to spring himself and a break another tackle and now Wazoo is back in front on the ground to work the clock, they'll go to the air. Balls out. He's off Winston. And he was ruled down. Yeah. See the ball bobbling? Yep. The ball is bobbing. Does he regain control of it? I don't know if he does. The runner fumbled prior to being down. The ball was recovered in the immediate continuing action by UCLA. First down. They do get it off. Felton's got it in his hands, and the playmaker scores for UCLA! In a long time. Hit from behind, and the ball is out! And the Bruins have recovered! And the return of Keyshawn Lucier South with the exclamation point! Sixth takeaway.
away for the defense. This win, I'll tell you, this, this could catapult your team. What an unbelievable game tonight. Bruins down big on the road.